there, if any of that, Tori here. How are we? I hope you're all doing well. So we're just gonna ignore the fact that we're in the exact same location. I'm wearing the exact same pajamas as the last video. In case you couldn't have guessed, it's literally like, you know, an hour later. I had a bit of a good mail day today, so we are unboxing it. That's that, that's that. So we've got a little bit of a different unboxing today, but honestly, it is so cute. I just thought we had to do it together. So it's not Disney, I'm sorry. But I keep seeing like adverts for this brand like on my Instagram, on my Facebook, because you know how it is with like internet bots and all that they know what you like they know everything you are going to be interested in and they narrow down your ads on your social medias to fit you to a t this shoe brand honestly i don't know how i hadn't found them sooner and i'd been looking for a pair of shoes like these for a while and then i came across this brand and these shoes and i've been i've had them screenshotted on my phone for so long and I kept looking at them and they're honestly a little bit more than I'd usually spend on shoes. I'm usually a Primark girl for shoes. So they're a little bit, little bit more expensive than a Primark pair of shoes, I will be honest. But I've been looking at them for ages and I, when I ordered them, I was in the need of a pick me up kind of moment. So I was like, you know, Tori, you've had them in your wish list for long enough just get them so we got them so it is by the brook company koi koi k-o-i koi footwear and they are 100 vegan which we love to see i will be completely honest i already partially unboxed it oh i took it out of the bag but you know that's fine started undoing that and then i came to the box and i was like i was gonna do this with you so I quickly stopped. I didn't go any further. I haven't actually unboxed it. I took it out of the bag, which, you know, that's the boring part. We are here to actually, oh, I, so I haven't looked at the shoes yet, but I thought, let's go do this next bit together. So if I remember correctly, these shoes are the, I'll leave them up here what they're called, but I'm pretty sure they're like the special edition name is Princess Little Secret, Little Secret Princess something tiara diamante you can tell by the title of them they're going to be cute and from i've never ordered from this company before and look at the box look at it so it's got this really cool pattern all over it it says 100 vegan it's koi footwear a really snazzy box look at that let's just have a moment for the box let's go on to the main event Okay, so they're all in this tissue paper. Oh, the, the shoes come in individual bags. That's really cute. Okay, so there's one. Oh, they've got... They've got that new shoe smell. And the fact that it's vegan makes it even better, you know? Oh, they... Mm, I'm so excited to take them out. Okay, I can't wait any longer. Let's have a look at them. Look at it! Let's just get the other one out. Look at them! Aren't they just like the princess shoes of dreams? <gasps> the first thing that I just want to say is they're a bit higher than I was expecting, but that's absolutely fine. I have no issue with that. <laughs> okay, so here's just like a little overview. So they're like this pastel baby pink with these silver stars embroidered all over and they just have a silver buckle for a fastening wedge itself is probably what like two and a half maybe three inches and then the whole shoe is on a platform which what that's probably like an inch so the actual heel, this is what, it's higher than I expected, but as I said, you know, nothing wrong with a little bit of a heel. So these were £45, which is initially why I just had them on my wish list, um, but I literally looked at them so often, I had them screenshotted in 
on my camera roll and they kept coming up as adverts on like my Instagram stories and my Facebook feed. So eventually I just gave it. <laughs> so I got these in a size six. So I'll try them on in a minute to see how they are for fitting. I probably will just have to like wear them in a bit because that looks like it's gonna, you know, just to get it fitted and all. But yeah, as for quality, they do feel really good. Like for it being a vegan leather, it is really beautiful, it's really nice, it's really smooth and all the embroidery is absolutely gorgeous and this the actual wedge bit at the bottom i can't really describe what it's made out of but it feels like it's going to be quite sturdy i'll only wear these for my pillow just fell down behind me i only obviously wear these for like fancy events at the end of the month i've got a special pr event to go for which is lounge fly related i am probably vlogging that so these will probably be part of that outfit and then next month my best friend is having her engagement party so i think those will be part of that outfit They're so cute i'm honestly so happy with them so obviously i am just in my pajamas i'm just gonna go find some socks out of my drawer so we can try these on okay socks are on let's just start off by taking out the packaging from inside the toe undo the buckle As i said i have got these in a uk size six but i personally my shoe size varies between what shop i buy from so well, actually let me just put on the other shoe but we might be having a cinderella moment right here this feels like a perfect fit as i was saying before i put the shoe on every store i shop in i seem to be something different whether it's like primark shoe zone wherever I'm buying a shoe from, I seem to be something different. It ranges between like a five, six, seven. I've got these in a six and honestly they are, they're pretty, fitting pretty well. Just got them slipped on, but let's do up the buckle and have a little tester. excuse the bad lighting because i've just stepped away to look in my mirror but look at them they're honestly the perfect fit and like you can't even notice how, how like the height on them they are so comfortable okay so i'm just gonna talk about them whilst wearing them because i don't want to take them off i'm fully obsessed they are they're giving me all the princess vibes and I am here for it. They are so comfortable. And what I was saying before I tried them on thinking, oh, I'll just have to break them in just to like, like even out, you know, the, the heel to make it shaped a bit. As soon as I put my foot in the shoe, it just all naturally bent round and fitted into place. And it is so comfy. The, so what did we say that we're like, about i want to say like a three inch heel you can't notice them because of how like the wedge is and like how the entire shoe is on a platform it's not like you're wearing heels it's all it's just all flat it's absolutely fine and i'm a heels kind of girl anyway so it wouldn't have bothered me at all it's so comfy i've gone for a little walk around the house in them i've made eddie my puppy look at them he was half asleep so i don't think he cared but i cared I cared. I held them up next to my dress. So for that PR event that I'm going to at the end of the month, I've already got all my outfits sorted. As soon as they sent me the invite, I was like, right, let's get an outfit. I held them up next to that. That goes so well. I'm so happy with them. They are definitely worth the price tag, I will say. Let me, uh, I, I, I have to take them off to show you, don't I? And I can't talk about shoes while not showing you the shoes. Hang on, let me take them off. I mean, it also does feel and look very weird me wearing fancy shoes around the house whilst wearing a snitty. It's a look. <laughs> They're like a pink version of Dorothy's shoes. <laughs> There's no place like home. There's no place like home. <laughs> do you think if I wear them and do that, it will like take me to Disneyland Paris? 
it's worth a shot though isn't it so yeah honestly i could not be happier with them i'm now kind of you know annoyed with myself that it, they sat in my wish list for so long but you know i needed to pick me up they definitely picked me up so one of the things that stopped me from buying them for so long was the price tag now i've got them i've worn them i've they're definitely worth it like the design is stunning it's giving all you know the fairy princess cute vibes we love it the quality we love it vegan even better and i sometimes i can struggle to get shoes to fit me as i said i'm a different size depending on what shop you go to these fit like a glove and the, the heels didn't rub at all they were fine the toes were just perfect because like sometimes when you get like heels like new shoes or heeled shoes you know your toes just feel like cramped and claustrophobic these were just literally like a cinderella moment i put them on and it was like they were made for my feet honestly very very happy with them so i think we have gathered how much in love i am with these shoes I cannot wait to wear them to the special events I've got coming up. Honestly, I'm very excited. I'm already like, I'm five foot seven, which I wouldn't say is tall. I'd call that average height. But among all my friends, I'm the tall one. <laughs> well, I'm five seven. These are three inches. It's gonna make me what, like five ten? Sorry, friends. <laughs> but yeah, I. I should probably put them down and end the video because otherwise I'll just keep showing you and going look how pretty how pretty so I know that was a little bit of a different content for you but honestly I thought you'd enjoy unboxing them with me because they are so stunning and it is kind of nice to get a little bit of different content out there every now and again so if you did enjoy this video please pop that thumbs up button so I know you enjoyed it so I can work out what content you guys would like to see in the future if you'd like to see more from moi and you would like to see the PR event that I am going to do click subscribe down below and so you don't miss the vlog or anything coming up do ding the notification bell while you're down there and I will see you guys next time. Bye!